Well, my name is Sebastián Irarrazabal. Uh, I would say that I am an architect and also I am an educator. Well, I would say that my philosophy is founded on three pillars. One is the idea of care. The second one is the idea of translation. And the last one is the design strategy and has to do with repetition. I would say that that are the three pillars of the way I approach design. If I have to explain that care is the, um, let's say, is the, 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 it's an attitude of architects uh, in order to uh, welcome in uh, difference, no? And I would say the translation is a, a strategy to, to design uh, in order to be able to establish bridges with the context. And I would say that the third one, um, repetition, is a design strategy that uh, somehow uh, results in experience of living that has to do with the fulfillment of expectation rather than with surprise. And at the same time, it's a design strategy that allows for uh, economy, not only economy in design, but also economy in perception. Well, I deal with the theme of the symposium, Form Follows the Planet, uh, saying that the slogan somehow should be a form follows courtesy. And courtesy is a, a human attitude of welcoming difference and by definition the, the acceptance of the differences. No? And this means to accepting um, different uh, cultures, different um, abilities of people, and also different species. No? I think um, practicing the notion of courtesy is the way we can deal with the environmental problem that we are facing nowadays. Uh, I think that's very important for the students to have the opportunity to hear from first hand the, the experience of practitioners no? and how they, they deal with real issues that uh, affect society and have to do not just with the theory, no? but also with the, uh, the dilemmas and the limitations that reality poses. And for the architects that are invited to this kind of conference, um, mean uh, opportunities, no? opportunities for, for new approaches, opportunities for design. And at least when I was a student, uh, my experience hearing other architects uh, was very inspiring.